and welcome to Ties TV. I'm Steph Whitaker, and today I'm joined by Yulu, who is the VP of Business Operations, STA Pharmaceuticals, a Wuxi Aptech company. Hi, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me here. So why did Wuxi STA decide to build a Tides um, oligo and peptide platform? Uh, Wuxi STA, we're an established CDMO for small molecules, um, and we offer both API and drug product solutions. Mm -hmm. um, so over the last year alone, we worked with over 280 customers globally. It is through the conversation with many of these customers, we realized that in today's environment, companies choose their molecule modalities largely based on the therapeutic targets. Okay. Um, so it's based on their request that we decided to expand our expertise beyond small molecule into the synthetic oligos and peptides. So for the peptides, it's a more uh, mature areas, and this field has been growing for the past uh, several decades. Uh, Wuxi Aptech, actually our parent company, has been started offering peptide discovery services since 2011. But in 2018, STA decided to build our platform focused on the peptide process development and large-scale manufacturing. This is largely driven by some of our long-standing large farmer clients. Um, they were accustomed to work with our cultures and quality system, so they requested us to build uh, beyond the small molecules into the peptide development and manufacturing. Um, oligonucleotide, on the other hand, is a relatively new emerging field. For many years, uh, there's only a handful of clinical candidates, um, but in recently, we've seen more and more development in this area, in particular with the commercial success of Biogen Spinranza that spurred the growth of this industry. Again, through many discussions with our longstanding partners, mm. um, they requested us to build high quality, cost effective platforms for to support their oligo program development. So that's basically why we did it. And this is um, also in line with our vision to short the time and lower the cost of new drug development and fulfill the dream that every drug can be made and every disease can be treated. Um, and can you describe your platform? Uh, sure. Both of our oligo and peptide platforms are built in Changzhou City, China. So China, Changzhou is a established a small molecule integrated process development and manufacturing facilities. And this facility has been approved by both US FDA as well as a China NMPA. Uh, we built both uh, capabilities on the site. Um, for the Oligo today, we've already had the established process development team, as well as the CGMP 100 gram per batch production lines. Mm -hmm. and meanwhile, we're building the kilo scale production lines. And this facility will be up and running by the end of this year. Uh, meanwhile, we worked on a various of the molecule modalities, including the DNA, siRNA, and also because it's co-located with a peptide platform. So we worked on many projects um, that's a morpholino oligos and the peptide conjugates. On the peptide side, we also established the process development as well as a kilo scale GMP production lines. Meanwhile, we're constructing a larger scale peptide production facility capable to hun handle hundreds of kilos production a year. So this facility will be up and running by the first half of next year. What's unique about our oligo and peptide platforms are in, I would say, the following five areas. Okay. First of all is the scalability. So both of our oligo and peptide facilities in Wuxi were capable to handle from discovery to development and all the way to commercial scale. A second is our conjugation chemistry expertise. Our team has handled many of the different conjugations, such as oligo or peptide conjugated with a small molecule linkers, uh, with another antibody or another peptide. Third is uh, solution plus uh, solid phase hybrid chemistries. So, Unlike many of the established players in oligo or peptide CDMO space that just focus on one molecule modalities, STA, um, our platform are built upon the industry leading chemistry powerhouse. That makes us uniquely positioned 
to handle some of the novel hybrid chemistry challenges. Fourth is a global quality standard. Our quality system was designed and also has been approved by regulatory agencies around the world. The fifth is our established analytical platforms. So in both areas, we've established a very comprehensive analytical platforms to support the characterization, the method development and validation, the IPC release testing, ICH compliance stability studies, etc. And what do you see for the future um, in the Thai therapeutic space? We believe both the oligo and the peptide therapeutics will continue to thrive. And in particular, we saw four trends. First of all, is we saw molecules are become more and more complex. Uh, we've seen and worked on many of the different conjugates, uh, such as uh, oligopeptide conjugates, oligoantibodies, or peptide conjugates. Um, second of all, we saw development, com development timelines continue to be shortened. Mm -hmm. Third, we saw companies started to work on the global development and the regulatory filings much earlier than before. This is because some of the th new therapeutics are focused on the orphan indications. So in these cases, leveraging the global patient recruitment is a key. Mm -hmm. um, fourth, is we saw many of the companies are working on some of the major indications uh, in both areas. So this required the industry to come up with the new chemistries or more cost-effective manufacturing technologies to, st to support these large-scale commercial productions. So in summary, at Wuxi STA, we're committed to expand our capabilities and capacities by investing through the novel most cutting edge technologies and to develop the scientific expertise at every level. Thank you very much. Thank you for joining us.